it is day three. Day three of the second leg. Today we're, we'll, we're at Nassau and it's time to have fun. We'll see what this port has to offer. I hear many different things, but we're gonna go out there. But first we gotta go up to the Windjammer and yeah. All right, so we're about to head off the ship onto Nassau. We're late, I ain't gonna lie. It is, wow, 11.20. The gangway opened at, at wow, no, 8.30. Yeah, we're a bit late getting the late start in today. So this ship next to us, this is actually Allure of the Seas. It's an Oasis class ship. I'm quite familiar with uh, Allure or Oasis class ships. Real fun, but I'm gonna see if I can get a view to see side by side. Cause I showed you guys yesterday the difference between vision and freedom. And what's the difference in size? Like you could see like one's well, Freedom is way bigger than Vision, and I know this Oasis class ship is bigger than this Freedom class ship. Oh wow, God just lost his hat. Soon as he walked out of the gangway, like this dude, he, he was, wow, another dude just lost his hat. Wow, people just losing hats left and right. So he walked, as soon as he walked out, he, his hat flew into the water. So much for that idea. <laughs> And then I show you like this little kid here, he just lost his hat. But uh, we're gonna see what, what there is to do here in the Bahamas for the day. Technically, I will be back in the Bahamas for the Harmony repositioning to, to uh, geez, Galveston to Spain, the transatlantic. And this is actually Disney that's right next to us. You can see the, either that's Mickey or Minnie. There is a difference with Allure and Freedom. So yeah, this looks this looks really touristy as you walk out of here. Straight ahead, they got that little pink building. In case you get in trouble, that's the tourism police station. But of course, you know, these guys are selling stuff. I'd be careful, explore your options. I think it's almost like any other port, you know. The closer you start bargaining, closer to the port the more expensive it is the more further out you go the least expensive it is so i think i would rather just go out and walk a little bit and chill see, see some of this area over here you guys want to see the island? Take a little ride around the city, like the mini staircase, the fort, the Atlantis, some of the rum cake factory. How much is it just to go to a land? It's uh, so we'll show together. Uh, six of us? Six? It's like seven dollars a person. We were talking to him about doing a tour. And yeah, the guy Richie was talking about doing a tour of the island. $30 per person, just go go around, etc., etc. 15 passenger van. But outside, this is like the downtown area. This, and it looks like a bunch of like high end touristy shops and souvenir places. Uh -huh. Horse and buggy rides. We got a Harley store over here. And you can see right here, like, the port's right behind me. And through here, you got a bunch of the shops and things. The shops and things. Of all things, they got a Burger King over here.
Well, here's the strong market over here. It's a big colorful building. You can't miss it. You come out the port, you go right. You go down, you can't miss this place. But there's also a senior frog at the very end over here. And of course, they got, there's a carnival ship. The, sh the sunshine is here. So it looks like there's four cruise ships here today. Let me try to tell you that they can tell you the price. Oh, oh. Oh. Sorry. Oh. Oh, no. Good morning. everything Awesome, thank you. Uh -huh. mm. You like the gray one? Yeah. I'm talking about you. The straw market, as you can see, is real touristy. Just a bunch of touristy stuff. If you want to just bring back a little taste of the Bahamas, that's a good place to go. As the lady said, everything's on sale. <laughs> yeah, but I'm trying to find the best one. wife's trying to take home a mask but I think we'll come back but, but as you can see there's plenty of there's more aisles aisles on aisles on aisles on aisles there's plenty of this stuff like boom 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 so this is cool if you if you like the wood carvings and stuff like that this is Come on this other side of the straw market. They got a bunch of it. I mean, look, you can also find it on the inside in there, but there's much more variety and options over here. What's funny about it go going to different parts of the world is you see different, uh, the style of different things. Like I've seen masks in Mexico, masks in, you know, African masks, they just they have their own different like flair and flavor. So they're all different. But yeah. I believe that I know that it's not easy. Easy, yeah, easy. No, I cannot. I don't know. Hey, that's that's what you guys got here. This is cool. Got an elephant mask. Oh, is that like an octopus? No? No, no it's a fish on the coral. Oh, on the coral. It's oh. cool. Yeah, but Going past the carnival ship, but you can see like how blue, I don't know if you can pick this, if it's picking this up on camera, but how blue the water is. Man, it's like really nice. How blue that water is. Man. It's unbelievable. But that's carnival, sunshine. You got Disney. And then we're going over here to Royal. Today, we're going to get back on the ship. I hear tonight's French night, which they're supposed to have that warm apple cobbler. I'm excited for that. Man, I'm probably going to get two or three of them, to be honest with you. Um, yeah, y'all didn't watch the... If you didn't watch me going around Nassau, we got some rum cake. 
some pina colada rum cake and who knows no actually no 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 i'll save it for tomorrow i'll see you guys when i get back on the ship because we gotta get showered changed and all that stuff so i'll see you guys on the ship just got out of the shower it's four wow 4 40. gangway just went up 10 minutes ago damn look at that little crap man i gotta get rid of that tomorrow i think i'm gonna do the first I'm gonna do this for the first time that I've never done on a Royal Caribbean ship, and that is actually hang out by the pool deck and actually get in the pool, because I gotta get rid of this. I can't go back um, home with this thing. I need, I need it somewhat gone. But uh, tonight, it looked like, oh yes, it is French night. So this is the menu. They got escargot again. Oh, they got calamari on the menu. You know, I'll, I'll pick something from here, but what I'm most excited about is this warm apple cobbler, man. Uh, remember the night they had the blue apple cobbler? And I was like, what the hell? But man, I, I can't wait. So, I don't know. I might get something different because obviously there's no New York strip on the menu. So I'm going to have to get something different. Maybe I'll get some salmon. I don't know. Maybe, yeah, try something different. But uh, one thing that I want to do for sure, I told myself... I'm actually doing something now because I'm going to go down to deck four. I'm doing something that I've never done on a Royal Caribbean cruise ship. And that is actually watch a sail away. Well, I did do it on the embarkation days of, of both days. But I've never watched a sail away from one of the ports. Wow, that is loud. I'm curious to see if anyone is going to get left behind. It doesn't look like it because, I mean, the gangway is actually still technically down but actually what i'm gonna do is because i wanted to do something different i'm actually gonna um, go to the helipad so i have about an hour until dinner which the main dining is actually right there behind me and that's actually the deck that we're on we're on deck four so this little track around where you get to the helipad is technically I don't know if it's five or whatever, but to get to the helipad, you have to get down to four. But then once you get to the helipad, you'll walk up some stairs. You'll see here shortly. Look at this. You see the Sydney Portier Bridge straight ahead. You can see Atlantis off in the distance there. Man, this is, oh, this water in the Bahamas is, wow, it's something else. Let's get to the helipad. All right, I made it to the helipad. Ooh. All right. It's a really nice beach over there on the other side. I wonder who has access to that beach over there. Man, that's actually, that would be really nice. But yeah, we're still hooked up as you can see. But you get a different view this way. Guess that the bridge off in the distance actually gets you connected to that island. I don't know what that is over there in that portion. Getting ready to get on out of here. So if this is the case, that means the gangway should be up. Let me go check the gangway. Yep, gangways are up. Looks like everyone made it, I hope. I hope no one tries to come out anytime soon, but you can see disney they're they're fired up and they're looking like they're getting ready to get out of here shout out to them i, I didn't run into, into anyone from disney it's kind of funny this is one of the few ports where i actually didn't get to talk to any of the passengers but man look at that water man that water just looks amazing so it looks like this is interesting Disney does something different. That is very unique by Disney, I'm not gonna lie. pulling out 
Now, Carnival is on the other side of Disney. I'm not sure if Carnival is still here. We're going to find out shortly. Off goes Disney. Carnival, the Sunshine, they're actually still here. So, surprise, surprise. But it looks like we're probably the next ones to leave because we should not be moored anymore. Yep. The guys, they, everything's taken off. All Royal has to do is pull these up. Allure, they, they're still moored. So I guess they're going to be one of the last to leave along with Carnival because Carnival is moored. They're still attached. But this is actually cool. Cool experience watching the other ships sail away in this capacity because when we left Miami, I didn't come out here. I was actually on the pool deck. Uh, for the sail away so i didn't get to see it from this angle so this is quite different there goes disney one cool thing about freedom you see i'm here on the helipad but on allure you can't get on the helipad on allure they don't allow you kind of suck and we're off you can hear you can hear the engines rumbling get the cool sound like Disney they get the music oh there we go there we go it's a pissing contest man it's so funny like looking at a lure in the background you probably can't see it but their solarium's huge. It looks like in 15 minutes, they're gonna have a parade that grows through the promenade. The parade's gonna be about 18 minutes long. When I was on Harmony, I missed the parade. So I actually, I'm actually gonna try to catch the parade before it starts. So this should be pretty cool. Talk about fun fact. I did not even know this about fr uh, Freedom. They actually have a Guinness Book of World Records for the world record for the largest passenger liner cruise ship was achieved by Freedom this ship, wow, 4,370 guests launched in Southampton, UK in 2006. Wow. Impressive, impressive. deep into the Caribbean, but man, look at that water. Man, this is absolutely amazing. Just like how blue this water is. Like, look at that. Amazing, but it's time for me to go dining. I gotta get back inside. All right, warm apple coppers down. I'm on my second one. I have the beef tenderloin and the salmon. Man, I'm bad about getting the food stuff, but they're turning up already. I don't know what's about to happen. Maybe maybe the staff's gonna do a little dance or something. But man, I'm on to the second one. I might get another one because I love this warm apple cobbler. Mm. Boy, right now I was in crisis mode. I actually thought I lost my GoPro. I thought I, I thought that I left it at the dining, but I actually left it in the room because we had to take the kids to Adventure Ocean on my way to the comedy show. So now I'm late to the comedy show. Like, look at me. Look at this. Look at this. I now think I he just says he smokes weed, guys. Now I gotta, I, okay, there we go. I found my party. Any, any single people on here? Slim Pickens, Tyler. <laughs> I like how the 12 year old put up her hand. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. you how old? 14. Sorry. Sorry. I didn't mean to disrespect you. He's still going to jail. All right. 
All right, this is so funny. So, as I, I just got out of the uh, the comedy show, but what's funny is, as I was in such a rush to get this camera, I actually ran into the couple we were sitting at the same table on our first cruise in Harmony. We ran, I ran into them uh, as I was. I guess inside of the main dining, I was in such a rush trying to find my camera because I thought I lost it. I didn't see them as I was running in, but they saw me and it's, it's quite wild uh, to be honest to the, our first cruise ever, the people that we're actually sitting at the main dining room table with is actually on the same cruise <laughs> months later, the year after. Wow, it is a small world. So it was actually really nice to see them because they were cool people. It wasn't like, we had a cruise and we had a miserable experience and we were like dreading having to sit next to this couple for dinner every evening. But they're cool people, so we'll see. Hopefully, um, and maybe we'll end up on another cruise together. So <laughs> it's just a funny how it's such a small world. But now I think we're gonna go to this game show in about an hour. So for now, we're gonna chill. Uh, have some fun, just relax, really. Uh, me, I'm trying to like cool down because I almost had a damn heart attack thinking that I lost this camera. But the, you know, the one thing, good thing about <laughs> me possibly losing this camera is I'm on a cruise ship. So worst comes to worst, it wouldn't be too hard finding this camera. Although when I was in Turkey, I thought I lost my camera. That would have been a whole different story. And if I lost my camera in Turkey, I probably wasn't going to find my camera ever again. So. It just is what it is, but so far, this is day three. We got one more day, one last sea day. You see, you know, people are just kind of out and about and just having fun. I'm here on deck five in the promenade. I'm actually right outside guest services, you upper uh, floor of Boleros, and you can see everything uh, from the Royal Promenade. So just chilling, just a fun night, uh, winding down wasn't too crazy today like it i mean look i was pretty all over the place in nassau but you know now i'm just kind of kind of winding down uh i ain't gonna lie my feet are sore but i'll check back with you guys uh when i get into the game show because it's actually right behind me here at uh, the star lounge so i'll see you in about an hour no worries they're all right be we're at another game show team high team. or low all right so it's going down before we right start this game show let me introduce all right let me myself. tell you something one of the dangers of like going back to your room to go just kind of relax <laughs> before something if you have 30 <laughs> minutes or an hour just be careful going back right. to your room in between For anything because you very, may not come out easy. you may end up taking a nap and I'm waking up and missing the show yeah that happens actually quite a bit but and we actually made it actually i got quite comfortable where i was like you think it's i just want to chill i want to okay. just watch the maps get For example, you know. back, back in effect in the silent party i've done it again i've done it again i'm, I'm in the silent party i didn't think i would make it out here again oh look where's the dj oh wow the cardi b Car cardi b All right, now look, this is the adult silent party. Y'all can hear how live it is in here, right? A weird experience. Look, in the comments, let me know who started this silent party nonsense. Y'all know how this works. Y'all hear this. song kills my mood. Look, I'm trying to tell her. She's in the blue crowd. Go ahead. Go. Get out. Get out there with them. Go. Go. Oh. You, yeah, you got blue. Cha yeah, join the blue crowd. Yeah. There you go. There you go. This is what people should be dancing to right now. Okay, I've heard enough of this damn song. You know this song. I swear to you, I've heard this song two to three times a day for the last seven days. I'm gonna kill myself. Oh my God. I, I can't change the station quick enough. 
I gotta do this. Oh, they got the okay. They got the genuine ones. Uh oh, riding my pony. Oh, she's the only one. We got a Lone Ranger. We got a Lone Ranger. <laughs> <laughs> oh no, this damn Macarena. Ay, ay, ay. Look what happens when you can't party till you drop. She couldn't handle it. She's like, I'm dying. This was her. Yeah, she's been wanting to party, but look at her. Mm -hmm. I'm tired. My feet are tired. Mm hmm. Your feet are tired, your legs are tired, everything is tired. Uh-huh, exactly. Yes, shut the club down for her. She couldn't handle it. We made it through the silent party and a little bit into the nightclub experience. Okay, it is the nightclub? almost one o'clock. It's 12.53, tech, if you want to get technical. Um, that's going to wrap up today's vlog cuts tomorrow is the last day of the cruise so we gotta pack i gotta make sure everything is proper and in order oh. and you guys are in for a treat i'm not gonna say what but you'll have to stay tuned i'll see you guys in the next one